Hello, welcome to Daily News from Ajaya TV. Daily scientific meetings of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in holy city of Qom, Iran. The residence of His Eminence Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sadaq Husseini Shirazi, a respected religious authority, hosted another enlightening scholarly session in the holy city of Qom, attended by numerous scholars, religious figures and students of Islamic seminaries. This meeting delved into various topics pertaining to Islamic ethics, Islamic jurisprudence, Islamic history, etc. In this session, one of the attendees asked this question. Does a wife inherit from the lands that the husband has bought, sold, and traded with? In response to this question, His Eminence has stated, Yes, the wife does not inherit only from the land of the house or the garden where the husband lived, neither from the land itself nor from its price. Additionally, she does not inherit from the attachments to the land, such as buildings and trees, but she does inherit from their value. However, with respect to the lands that the husband bought, sold, and traded with, and which were not for sustenance, she inherits from them just like the other heirs. Of course, daughters and mothers inherit from the land, and only the wife does not inherit from the land where her husband resided. The esteemed viewers of Marjaya TV can watch these sessions live and directly on this TV network, a collection of other TV channels, and also on the Al Shirazi app and TV boxes simultaneously with these sessions at 11.15 a.m. Qom local time. Members of Grand Ayatollah Fayyaz's delegation visit Grand Ayatollah Shiraz's delegation in Medina. The delegation of the Grand Ayatollah Sheikh Ishaq Fayyaz visited the delegation of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sadaq Hussein Shirazi in the sacred city of Medina. During this visit, Sheikh Talib Salehi, the office manager of the religious authority in Karbala, and Sheikh Jalal Ma'ash, a representative of the religious authority, along with other members of this delegation, welcomed the visiting delegation. During this meeting, both parties discussed and exchanged views on various issues related to Hajj. Members of Grand Ayatollah Garifi's delegation meet with members of Grand Ayatollah Shiraz's delegation in Medina. Members of the delegation of the Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Alauddin al Garifi visited the delegation of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hussein Shirazi in the holy city of Medina. This visit took place during the activities of the two delegations during the Hajj season of 1445 AH in Medina. During this meeting, both parties discussed various issues related to the Hajj rituals. Grand Ayatollah Shiraz's delegation meets with pilgrims in Holy Medina. The delegation of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Husseini Shirazi met with the members of a pilgrimage group during their activities in Medina for the Hajj season of 1445 AH. During this visit, Sayyid Muhammad Hussein al Husseini, a member of this delegation, delivered a speech to the pilgrims discussing the increase of blessings through gratitude and importance of seizing the opportunity of visiting the house of God. Continued cultural and religious activities of Dar al Misbal Shari School in Karbala. The Dar al Misbal Shari School, affiliated with Misbal Hussein Cultural and Charitable Institute in Karbala, one of the centers associated with the religious authority, continues its activities in teaching specialized courses in oratory and public speaking, as well as lessons related to the recitation of the Holy Quran. Muhammad al Silawi, the head of this school, stated that dozens of young Husseini enthusiasts interested in serving the Husseini pulpit and its ancient heritage are receiving necessary training in this field. He emphasized that the students of this center are engaged in competing educational courses in Quran and jurisprudence, in addition to supplementary courses in oratory. The Darul Mesbal Shari School, one of the centers associated with Mesbal Hussein Cultural and Charitable Institute, provides lessons and courses to talented young individuals with beautiful voices, training them as eulogists and speakers dedicated to the service of Imam Hussein, peace be upon him. This educational center was established following the guidance of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Husseini Shirazi. Director General of Education of Najaf Province visits Union of Shia Satellite Networks and Radios. The Union of Shia Satellite Networks and Radios, one of the centers associated with the religious authority in the holy city of Najaf, hosted Mr. Mardan al-Badiri, the Director General of Education of Najaf Province. During his visit to the Union's headquarters, he was briefed on its activities, toured various sections of the organization, and engaged in discussions with its members and officials. Oh.